now. So uh, Pierce County Council Member Pam Roach um, planning to retire. Uh, we were uh, going to talk to her today in our 730 hour um, a little bit about that retirement, um, the legacy she plans to leave behind. Um, that is not happening. So Brandy, I'll let you explain that situation. For sure. And we did want to offer an explanation yeah, because we had sure. just said she's coming up. She was in the studio. She was sitting down with me at the couches. Uh, unfortunately, she took issue with the fact that we were going to discuss some of the more controversial aspects uh, of her 30 years in politics, including not only her time on the Pierce County Council, but also her time in the state Senate. Uh, and, and I had been very straightforward with Pam Roach when she sat down with me that, look, you know, we're going to talk about the timing of your announcement that you're going to retire. Uh, we're going to talk about some of the things that you've done that you're proud of, but we also are going to talk about um, some of the controversy that has followed her throughout her career. Uh, she asked me what controversy as we were in the commercial break. I referenced a time when she uh, used a curse word um, at a public meeting directed at her own son. Uh, we were also going to talk about the fact that she had been barred from her own party's Republican caucus room for what was described as abusive treatment of staff. We were also going to talk about the fact that the Pierce County executive told staff to communicate with her just via email due to vulgar treatment. Uh, she did not want to talk about any of that. Uh, and as I informed Pam Roach in the commercial, it's our job to ask. Uh, certainly, she has had a 30-year career. Uh, there is much more to her career than some of these controversial moments, but it's simply our job to make sure that we cover that, that stuff that was in the press uh, for so long. She said if we asked about that, she wasn't going to do the interview. I was very firm with her that, indeed, we were going to have to ask, so she took off her microphone. Uh, we had a brief exchange in the lobby where I tried to convince her that, you know, this is your chance to sort of set the record straight if this is not uh, who you are and who you've been for these 30 years. She did have a conversation with our producers and uh, left. So we will not be speaking with Pam Roach this morning. We certainly wish her the best in her retirement. Uh, and in controversy aside, this is someone who served the state for 30 years. So, uh, you know, like we said, best wishes to her as she pursues the next chapter of her life. All right. Brandy, appreciate that yeah. because I, I, you know, you, you might have been out there asking. So, yeah.